Alright, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another review by Project. I'm Psycho again with you today, and in this one, I am going to be reviewing another installment in the Need for Speed series, Need for Speed Undercover. So, let's just get on to it. Need for Speed Undercover is the next installment that we've played in the series. Um, it was released in 2008 by Electronic Arts and the classic um, publishers for Need for Speed. So, um, let's just get on to the graphics and everything. The graphics are, as you can see, quite amazing actually. It has more of a movie look and than the other um, Need for Speeds that were released up to, up to this part. Um, and it features a, a different story than the others, actually. You're actually an undercover agent in this one, um, and not a typical um, street racer that goes against the law, but you actually work with the law. Um, so, yeah, that's pretty much as far as the story goes. Um, the graphics were actually buffed up and from the previous parts and the new games and everything well the new cars and everything were added to to the game to make it even better to um, to make it even more popular among the among the game among gamers and they actually did it really well especially with the cutscenes because they are actually recorded they are not computer um, generated by computer but um, they are recorded with true actors and everything so um, as far as the gameplay goes the gameplay has pretty much been kept the same from the other ones they have added some new race types and new modifications to the cars that you can actually um, do and use um, some cars must be action must actually be really modified in the options um, to get the so you can get the most out of them um, so yeah um, it's another great need for speed game that was released after all the other pretty much good ones so that's gonna be all from my side in the meantime don't forget to like and subscribe comment on the videos and I'll be joining you guys in the next one